Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome to Basic Engineering Mathematics. That is chapter number two, and uh, that is name of the chapter number two is of course fractions. That is continued from the last uh, episode, and let's take a look what we are going to discuss today. And these are the topics that I had decided for the today's lecture. Very very simple topics. That is multiplication of fractions and uh, its opposite. That is the division of the fraction. In the previous episode, we had decided the oppos two opposite terms, and we had applied the addition and subtraction that are the two opposite and or contrasting terms, uh, and we applied the addition and subtraction operations on the fractions in the previous episode. While in today's episode, we are trying another contrasting pair that is the multiplication and division on the fractions, and see what happens. First of all, let's talk about the multiplication of the fractions. To multiply two or more fractions together, the numerators are first multiplied to give a single number and then denominators. Okay. First of all, let's take a look at this example. 2 by 3 multiplied by 4 by 7. Numerators are multiplied with themselves. 4 multiplied by 2, that is simple case 8. And denominators are multiplied by themselves. For example, 3 is multiplied with 7 then it becomes 21 remember if there is a uh, these are the in simplified form and if, th if for example uh, if these number are not in simplified form and they further need to be cancellation process here uh, and um, then they need to be cancelled here to become this question as simple as possible images could see in this whole lecture by basic engineering mathematics by John Baird this is the book I am following from the starting day and uh, maybe I told you in the previous lectures but uh, if I didn't then note this I am following this book this is a very good book I recommend to purchase you this book and uh, this is a very good book basic engineering mathematics that is also I use this uh, title in our series because uh, it's easy to that's why maybe you f found this uh, easier to search because this is the same uh, outline I am following of this book but uh, sometimes I added some stuff that I found maybe easier in other books but the main book I am following that is the basic engineering mathematics by John Baird uh, okay let's take another look uh, if there is a number that is 7 multiplied by 2 by 5 it means if there is nothing uh, here in the denominator it understood there is a 1 and uh, 7 by 1 that multiplied by 2 by 5 it means the numerator is 7 and the denominator here it is 1 7 by 2 that is 14 and 1 by 5 that is 5 so if you want to change this improper fraction to mixed number definitely this is already discussed so many number of times that so I cannot spare the time here example number 2 and these are the two uh, improper fractions and that you need to multiply 3 by 7 multiplied by 14 by 5 when 14 is multiplied with 3 then it becomes a huge number so first of all let's take a look if there is any cancellation process 3 can be cancelled out with the this denominator and with this denominator as well because these denominators are going to multiply it and they will become a single number so 3 can be cancelled out with 7 and as well as if it, it's cancelling here we can cancel out 3 with also this term but not with the numerator okay so if, if for example this is a 14 is the numerator of the 15 but it can be cancelled with any denominator uh, in a row for example here also if another term is multiplying with for example 1 over 7 is also in a row and it's multiplying with 14 over 5 and if 7 is cancellation 7 can also be cancelled with 14 1 or 3 so so uh, here you can see that 7 1 7 into 1 7 and 7 into 2 14 so it is cancelling here and 3 into 1 3 and 3 into f uh, uh, 3 into 5 that is 15 so it can be cancelled out here first of all let's uh, take this step by step and first of all we cancel it 3 1 and 3 into 1 3 and 3 into 5 15 so these are the highlighted portions that are cancelled out 3 into 1 3 and 3 into 5 15 so it it is now 1 multiplied by 14 and the denominators are 7 multiplied by 5 dividing numerator and denominator by 7 gives cancels other terms 7 into 1 7 and 7 into 2 that is 14 1 multiplied by 2 and 1 multiplied by 5 that is 2 by 5 
this is the simplified form the simple rule for division now we are going to discuss the division division is again very simple and is a same process just a trick that is you must know uh, note about this that is if 2 by 3 is dividing by 3 by 4 you just need to replace this sign to make it again multiplication that we had already discussed for example if i want to change the sign here 2 by 3 is as it is i want to solve this in, in the way of multiplication to replace the uh, sign of the division with multiplication and i already explained in the first slide that division and multiplication are contrasting terms means to say these are the reverse terms so if it is a division if i want to change it into reverse process or in contrasting term that is uh, in contrary to the division so i need to also uh, change this term into a uh, and I want to twist this term for example if it is 3 by 4 I change the numerator into denominator you can see that 3 is if here is, is a denominator and it is changed into denominator here and here 4 is in denominator and it is changed into numerator so means to say uh, the next term to the uh, division sign is changed and inverted into the second fraction that is uh, here you can see that 3 is here in the denominator which was before here in this case it is in numerator and 4 is gone on the upside so 4 is multiplied by 2 this is 8 and 3 is multiplied by 3 that is 9 if further cancellation is required we need to solve the cancellation process so here another example that you can see that the if my, I want to change this division with multiplication sign simply I need uh, to change the conversion that is 21 by 8 here you can see that this is changed here so if further and you must notice if there is any cancellation that you must cancel out to make it simple before multiplication so 7 into 1 7 7 into 3 21 so you can see that this is 7 into 1 7 that is now changed by cancellation and it is now 3 3 into 3 very simple now 9 and 8 into 1 that is 8 so change into mixed number that is very very simple already discussed let's take another look of the mixed numbers simple if you want to solve the mixed number first of all change these expressions step number one into improper fractions for example 5 into 5 that is the multiplication sign here when you are going toward this side 5 into 5 25 and then add 25 plus 3 that becomes 28 denominator or it remains the same so this is how this is changed into 28 by 5 so you can see that uh, this term can also be changed 7 into 3 uh, 21 plus 1 um, 22 and denominator must remain the same and this is the way how we change this 22 by 3 and this our next step is to change the division sign uh, sorry next step is to cancel out if, if further cancellation uh, or you can change if no cancellation and already in simplest form then just change this division sign to multiplication sign here if you want to uh, this is now a multiplication sign and uh, uh, you can see that uh, if there is no cancellation then uh, you need to continue but if there is a cancellation start from the lowest prime number that is now 2 into 11 that is 22 then here 2 into 1 2 and 2 into 4 8 so it, here it becomes 14 and here it becomes 11 now it is already in simplified form, simplified form and we need to continue 14 multiplied by 3 that is 42 and 11 into 5 that is 55 so this is the answer if you need to convert this answer into the mixed number because uh, you can see that the, if it is required to mix numbers divided by mixed number uh, the answer uh, should be also be in mixed number then you can simplify it and convert it into uh, the mixed number that is not an issue because we had already take this look uh, take a look at the homework that I want to give you that is a very very basic question so this today's episode is very very simple and uh, almost just multiplication and uh, nothing is different so I hope you like this video and uh, you enjoy this today's video and just recap your uh, uh, just recap your uh, mindset and uh, you already know about multiplication and division and I was just trying to cover all this labels uh, very very fastly and very precisely because we, I want to uh, move as soon as possible I will try to move towards the main questions that are starting from the next uh, chapters so hope we will discuss the further discussion will be continued next time watch learn grow see you next time